السلام عليكم ورحمة الله وبركاته Islamic Academy of Riverside Presents أحكام التجويد أحكام التجويد Rules of Tajweed and we still with noon ساكنة and تنوين rules أحكام النون الساكنة والتنوين أحكام النون الساكنة والتنوين نون ساكنة and تنوين rules And before that, you know, before we start the new rule, let's um, refresh our information, our brain. Uh, what does noon sakina mean? What does noon sakina mean? As we said before, noon sakina is the letter noon. Noon sakina is the letter noon with sukun. So it is the letter noon, sa it is the letter noon with sukun. And when the letter noon has sukun, it's called noon sakina. And it means the letter noon is free from any vowel above or underneath it. So we don't have a or e or o sound. No fatha, no kasra, no dhamma. What does tanween mean? Tanween is a single vowel with a hidden noon sakina. Tanween is a single vowel with a hidden noon sakina. So here, when I see the letter B with kasra tan, B with one kasra B, and the other the other kasra is a hidden noon sakina. We pronounce this noon, but we don't write it. So I say bin bin B with dhamma tan, bun B with fatha tan, ban. So we have bin. Bun, ban, and as you see here, we just read uh, the letter with the single vowel, and the other vowel is a hidden noon sakina, and that's why we put tanween with noon sakina in the same area, and we give them the same rules. Why? Because tanween will give you a hidden noon sakina, and in Quran we focus, you know, um, mainly about what you pronounce, the sound you make. And in Quran, we have we have in Quran five ways to read or to pronounce the letter noon when it has sukun, when it carries sukun. We should look uh, next to this letter, to the letter noon, sakina, and see which letter comes after it. Because this letter will guide you and determine uh, how you should pronounce this noon. And we said here we have izhar. We already, alhamdulillah, dis you know, discussed this. Idgham مع الغنة Idgham with غنة And Idgham بلا غنة And today rule is Iqlab Iqlab Today rule is Iqlab And Iqlab letters are just one letter The letter B Remember that we said Idhar Hamza ha ayna ha ghayna kha Idgham مع الغنة Letters are Yanmu Yanun mim waw إضغام بلا غنة without غنة its letters are lam and ra إقلاب just one letter the letter ب so we have إظهار إضغام with غنة إضغام without غنة إقلاب and إخفاء we are here today rule number four الإقلاب 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 If you see the letter B after noon sakina or tanween, what should you do? What should you do if you see after noon sakina or tanween if you see the letter B? The letter B and noon sakina, like you know, they are enemies, they don't like each other. So, what we're gonna do is we will do a clab, which means change, change this noon sakina. And read it as meme with gunna. So what we're gonna do is change the noon into a meme. That's why we you see like uh, noon has a small tiny meme above it. And here this meme, what is the difference between you know when you have noon sakina and you change it into a meme? You don't read any sound, you read 
M sound. The difference between this normal meme when I say M mm, and the meme comes from Iqlab because you change this noon is the meme comes from Iqlab. We have, we have, you know, um, like small space hole between your lips when you read this meme. I don't say M, mm, M, mm, no, I say M. Mm, Air is still flowing. Air is still flowing. We will discuss this inshallah. So here, this why? That's why we put small tiny meme above the letter noon. Sakina. Why? To tell you that don't read this noon as in sound. Read it as im sound. And when you read it, don't say im. Don't close your lips. No. Make a small space. Small, you know. Um, hole or space between your lips and also Tanwin Quran when it followed by Ba it will be like one Fatha with a meme one Kasra with a meme one Dhamma with a meme still an in un <coughs> and this is Ayah here in Quran in Surah Al-Humaza Surah Al-Humazah, ayah number 4. Kalla la yunbadhanna. I will read it uh, without the rules. I will say, Kalla la yunbadhanna fil hutama. Number 1. You have noon sakina here? Noon sakina. No, I have noon mushadda. So this is not noon sakina. No, I don't think so. No, you have one here. Where? Yes, this noon. This noon has a meme above it, but it, it is not sukun. No, this is sukun. I told you sukun in Quran, noon sakina. In Quran has three forms. One of them, when you see the letter noon, has a small tiny meme. So this is noon sakina. This noon sakina is followed by. This noon sakina is followed by ba. What you're gonna do is you will change this noon. Make iqlab, you will change this noon into, you know, a meme. And when you read, we make ghunna here with this meme, and you don't make like your lips touching each other. I don't say, la yum bazanna, la yum, la yum bazanna. No, I say, la yum, la yum bazanna, kalla la yum bazanna fil hutamah. So I say, la yum, la yum ba, la yum ba zanna. And here the letter meme has ghunna. And as I told you before, ghunna, ghunna in all Arabic alphabet, just with two letters, the letter noon and the meme. The second ayah from Surah Al-Layl, Surah Al-Layl, wa amma man bakhila. What's Tagna? I number eight. So, do you have noon sakina here? Mm, no. Yes, you have. This noon has a small tiny meme. This is noon sakina. But this is not sukun. No, this is sukun as I told you. If you see noon sakina followed by ba, we put a small tiny meme above the noon. So, here we have noon sakina followed by ba. What you gonna do? Change this noon into a meme. Right? And we make ghunna. Mam, mam. I don't, I don't say mam, mam. You don't read this meme as a complete or normal meme. No. I don't say mam bakhila. Mam, mam. No. Mam, mam, mam bakhila. Wa amma mam bakhila wastaghunna. So this is about, uh, you know, uh, noon sakina, noon sakina followed by ba. What about tanween? Tanween followed by ba. I have here tanween, yes, kira min. The second, uh, uh, you know, we have one kasra and the other meme, this is, uh, uh, this is kasratan. So because I have after this tanween, I have ba. So what we're going to do is, look here. 
this second kasra is noon sakina, right? And this noon sakina is followed by ba. What you gonna do? You change this noon sakina and read as meme. That's why you see here one kasra and another meme. So I say kira mim mim barara. No, the first meme is normal meme, complete meme. So I close and uh, my lips are touching each other. I say kira kira mi mi mi. The other meme, no, we have small space distance between your lips when you read this meme. So I say kira mim kira mim. Kirami barara, kirami barara, and here we have one. Kirami barara. Again, remember the letter of iqlab only one letter. It is the letter ba, and nun sakina or tarwin doesn't like ba, so we change this nun sakina, or the letter nun comes from tarwin into a small tiny meme, and this meme. We uh, don't, you know, uh, read it as a normal meme. The only difference between normal meme and meme comes from uh, from iqlab is you make a small or a slight, uh, very very uh, small or space distance between your lips when you read it. Kira meme Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh.